they especially merciful. May peace, mercy and blessings of Allah the Almighty be upon all of you. This is Antko, Tutorial 11 and I am Umar Ibn Abid. Today we are going to look at Keyword List Tool and its Tool Preferences, how to create a keyword list, what is keyness, how to find unusually frequent and infrequent words. How to use a word list and reference corpus for keyword list. Actually word list or reference corpus uh, are same actually. So let's see. So first I will upload a file Australian English Web 2002 which consists of almost 10,000 sentences. Now let's switch on to the keyword list tool and press the button start. So when I press the button start, um, here, here appears no reference corpus word list is available. Generate a reference corpus word list in the keyword tool preferences menu. So I have to go to tool preferences. So in keyword list tool, uh, there are a few preferences uh, similar uh, alike other tools you can hide rank frequency and here is another option keyness effect keyword you can also hide these as well treat all data as lowercase if you want to treat uh, data in both case you can select this option show negative keywords I will show you later so here keyword statistic so here are yeah, long likelihood and other options as well so I will keep it by default keyword statistic threshold so it is also your choice uh, I will select all values uh, similarly keyword effect size measure and keyword effect size threshold now here is reference corpus so there are a few options use raw files or use word lists so actually uh, what is keyness or what is keyword list tool does uh, when uh, and for example now i am going to load a few reference corpus reference corpus mean i want to compare this file or any of these files which are here with the reference corpus so reference corpus uh, can be of your own choice so there are two options either use raw files or either use word list so first we will use raw files and then I will tell you how to generate a word list so now if you want to upload a complete folder then add directory or if you want to add a few files then press the button add files so here I will upload uh, all the files of Australian and English web 2002 and among these files I have uploaded one of these and that is 10,000 sentences so open and now press the button load and these files will be loaded in this way after uh, these files being uploaded press the button apply and then once again press the button start now it will give you a notification that and Kong needs to jump to the word list tool to generate a word list so press ok it will jump to the word list tool and jumps back to the keyword list so this is word list and now it will jump to keyword list so uh, these are the keyword list uh, and after comparing it this file with reference corpus so the highest and the most unusual frequent word is the uh, which means uh, you can say that uh, this word was much available in all those reference corpus as compared to this file and then a uh, keyness will be going down and down if I write the word for example good 
and then uh, don't press the button start uh, otherwise it will again start to generate keyword list so just press search only so uh, you can see that uh, this word good has very least keyness so it means it is not a usually frequent word actually it is you uh, you can say usually infrequent word uh, unusually infrequent word uh, and it means that this word is almost similar in reference corpus and in our file uh, because its keyness is so low so in this way you can uh, use raw files as a reference corpus now let's switch on how to use a word list as a reference corpus for, so for this first i will close these files quickly file and close all files now i will upload all these files of australian english web 2002 then open and now i will go to the word list tool and press the button start to generate a word list uh, now i will save this word list and i will use it as the reference corpus so this word list has been generated now go to file and select uh, the option save output or you can simply press control s now i will save this file and uh, and i will upload uh, this file as a reference corpus so in a few moments i will save it it is just uh, going to appear so i will write australian english web 2002 words list so you can save the file name with any of your own choice so at desktop i will save it now once again close all of these files and now upload the same file with which you want to compare open files and i will upload the same file australian english web 2002 which contains 10000 sentences now once again go to the tool preferences and in tool uh, preferences you have to clear uh, this list after clearing this list select the option use word list press the button add files and then upload that file which you have which i have just made as the word list so uh, this is australian english web 2002 word list and then press load press button apply go to keyword list start and kong need to jump to the word list tool so it is just appearing so you can see uh, the same result is available uh, either you use raw files or you use word list and uh, you can also uh, uh, take reference corpus uh, and other files so you can also um, you can come to know because i ha i also have uh, 2016 typical news but it was so big file so it will take much time here in this video so you can compare any of uh, two corpus uh, like this uh, similarly you can also sort by keyword and keyword sort by effect sort by key and uh, sort by frequency uh, if keyword and and then press the button sort now it will appear like keyword and a and then the words ending on b c like this way 
uh, and similarly uh, if you click on any of these like good and search only or any of other words like uh, food or good so it will take you to the concordance tool where you can find the context as well uh, now uh, if we want to see most uh, unusually infrequent words so you have to select uh, this option show negative keywords and then press the button apply start so now uh, those uh, words will also be appeared which are the negative uh, means so he, he are sort by keyness first we have to sort by keyness then we can see this so actually uh, the negative words are appeared in blue and if there are no uh, negative words so these will not be appear in blue and uh, the other thing is also that you can select uh, the the option then you can change the color in global settings for this so for example these are the most unusually infrequent words for example Morgan motivation because they have even minus zero or zero keyness so it means these words are actually similar in the reference corpus and in the file we have uploaded so this is all about you can also clone, clone the results as well so this is all about keyword list tool i hope you would have understood it if you have understood this video so subscribe my channel if you like this video Remember in your prayers, Jazakallah khairan and thank you.